comeback in general. Um, you know, Coach Bill, it was kind of the first time he saw something like that in 10 months, the way that you guys fought and came back to win. How do you think you guys pulled this one off? Just never, never batting an eye, I feel like. We're so, like last year, was, it, he made an emphasis on the fourth quarter games. We were one and four last year, so I just think coming in here, putting an emphasis on that and, you know, having the confidence to not bat an eye, keep fighting, keep pushing, you know, the second half, they didn't let it, we didn't let up any points, so I just think the defense doing a good job of that and the offense responding when the defense is making stops, you know, pulling us through. What did you see in Braden's eyes today? Killer. He's a dog. Um, he's, he's been like that, though, since, since he's got here. Um, you know, obviously we've had Tanner, but, you know, Braden's, Braden's a dog. Uh, he, he showed it today, um, and I think, you know, he's just going to keep it going. So you're not looking ahead yet to Ohio State, but that was one that a lot of people circled at the start of the season. Have you watched them at all? And what do you, what do you think a performance like this is able to do for the morale of, of the group going into that? Uh, I haven't, like, watched them as much as, you know, just being at home and probably seeing them play a little bit. But, um, you know, this is a tough team. Um, we got to go in there. Uh, we're at home, so it's going to be a good environment for us. Uh, just come out ready to play. And, you know, it's going to be a battle, just like today was. Skyler, early on, it seemed like some of the receivers were struggling with a few drops. You being called at the end of the game, you know, the catch that almost was ruled a catch, and then obviously the big bucket catch. How does it feel to kind of have your name called in those situations, and what were you kind of thinking about on the big play itself? I just think it, it means a lot to me. Um, you know, I haven't had probably the start to the season that I wanted. Um, I just think, you know, Coach Longo, Coach Brown, and Coach Fick just keeping trust in me, um, keeping that confidence in me, you know, keeping my confidence up, um, still coming at me on plays. And, you know, I just try to make as many plays as I can when the ball comes my way. How do you like those four receiver sets out there, a lot of them? I love today? it. Uh, a lot of space out there, me and Will in the slot. I feel like we can't be guarded in there because uh, you've got to – you gotta guard somebody, and I feel like somebody's always open. Uh, as y'all saw in that last, uh, what was it two minutes at the end of the half? I feel like we moved the ball so fast, you know, it's hard to stop us running that force. So. What was the play, the 30 yard over the shoulder when you had on the sideline? What, what was that play? Um, so basically, I was just looking at the corner. Um, if he was pressed, I had the two fade, which I ran. Uh, if he was off, I had kind of like a seam ball. Um, so I seen he was pressed, and you know, me and Braden, you know, we do those balls pulling every practice. So just like practice, uh, he you know gave me a chance and I wanted to play. After such a slow start, you know, you know, what was the message? How were you guys able to turn it around there? Just making plays, uh, responding. Um, I think our group is, 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 is getting very good at that. Um, you know, when things don't go our way to start, I think we don't bat an eye. Uh, we come out uh, still ready to play, still ready to focus um, and executing, which I think is, is big for us, uh, especially down the stretch like we did. Scott, you said how you may not have had the start you wanted this season. Has your confidence kind of wavered at some points this season? And if so, what did today kind of do for that? Uh, yeah, you know, you always have those little moments, um, you know, when, you know, you drop a pass or, you know, something doesn't go your way. You know, you have them on like, dang, but... Um, I just think having the guys around me and the coaches around me that, you know, always lifting me up, staying staying confident in me and keeping that trust in me is, is big for me. And, you know, I always stay confident in myself, um, which is which is good for me because I think, you know, as the season moves forward, I, uh, 